All right, so we're about to go pick up the Impala. Wilson said he's finally done, so. Had to replace the radiator in there too. So, I mean, it wasn't like bad or anything like that, but he had noticed it had a little leak in there, so it's best to just get it fixed. You know, it wasn't like crazy, and it like, I don't know. He said it looked like it was leaking, but to me it didn't look like it was leaking, but let's go ahead and just replace it. Better off being safe than sorry. Um, but yeah, we got an antifreeze, but I'll pick it up. Go pick it up. Let's see how she turned out. You know, again, you know, happy Monday. Appreciate everybody for rocking with me. Appreciate everybody liking the video. Everybody tuning into the stream. Everybody, you know, subscribing, dropping your comments. I appreciate all that. I just sold this Oldsmobile. So sold this Oldsmobile Alero. Then I bought for I don't even know if I made a video on it, but I bought it for like bought it for a few hundred bucks. Sold it for I bought it for like four hundred. Sold it for twelve. So twelve plus a little extra money is gonna be what I used to pay for this Impala. So pay for, take that money, pay for this Impala, and then flip the Impala and take all that profit. So you know that's how it works. So let's go down here and get it and see what we got. Well, I didn't know he was gonna paint the bumper. But he ended up painting it. So, hey, appreciate you, Wills. Appreciate you, Wills. Wilson. Let's suck that down. Oh, now I gotta get these little grill inserts. Now I gotta get these grill inserts. I didn't know he was painting the bumper, so I didn't know that's why he was waiting on me. That's why the price. That's why it was a little bit more expensive, but it's all good though. It's all good though. Wills, Wills got me taken care of. I'm gonna go do a better video when I take it back. I'm gonna stop so y'all can see the full after. So y'all already seen it before. So now y'all can see the after. So Wilson got us right. So I tell y'all, go get y'all a Wilson. If y'all ain't got y'all one, go get y'all a Wilson. Go get y'all a Wilson. Let that radiator suck that down. Don't oh, you need that jug or anything. But now I gotta go get some grill inserts. Good old 3.6. Let me look at my keys. Let this. I'll see y'all in a second. See y'all in a second. Alrighty, so we made it to our destination. Y'all know where we at. We at that church. Man, this church didn't took a this church didn't been a spot for a lot of videos. And a lot of my pictures taken. Y'all yeah, oh, see it? Yeah, woo, it's windy today. Y'all see it? Y'all see it immaculate? Immaculate, a little, little dirty. Look at that. When I throw them grill inserts in there, I'm gonna go grab those two grill inserts. This one. I'm gonna go to the Salvador, get this grill insert and get that one. Well, I might, if I can't find them. But y'all see it. Yeah, now that value. I didn't even know he was gonna paint the bumper. I brought him a certified bumper and he ended up painting it to a price. He had the extra paint, so he ended up painting it. You know, I just brought him a certified bumper. You know, I just brought him a certified. He ended up painting it up. Now I just gotta clean it up, like buff it and wax it and stuff like that, you know. Hit it with a little buff and wax and but good tires all around and stuff like that. 180,000 miles. Back, you gotta vacuum it out and wipe it, wipe it down and stuff. You know, you know that's the extra coolant because it was because I had to replace the radiator. But we got a brand new radiator in there. Look at that thing. Look at that thing. Look at that. Look at those headlights in there. Make it look. Ooh, those headlights make. Make that, make that baby. Oh yeah, that's the 
when those grill inserts get in there and it get boiled when they get cleaned all the way up and that tire shines and that tire look a little yeah that tire don't look that good okay that one's that one's pretty good that look like a whole different style of tire that's a whole different style of tire that's a, that's a whole different style of tires uh okay so what i actually might do uh it's, i don't know do i move this one to the back with that one i don't know i got definitely got to replace that one look at that look at that Wait till that grill insert. It look kind of bad because that grill insert all the way in. That grill insert ain't in there all the way. But the windows tinted. LT Limited 2014 Chevy in Pila. Got some low fuel though. You know, only no driving issues. Auto lights. Got the sun roof. Only thing on is the tire pressure, which you know garage door opener on star up in the sun into the roof clean ac so i might just take it to get a full detail up on it that's probably what i end up doing take it to get that full detail on it so they can clean like you know stuff like that so they can get these seats clean and then they'll go into all these crevices and they'll get all this stuff up so i'm gonna go get the oil change check the tire pressure you know probably get a tire or two probably two I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna put them on the front, back. God, Lee. They ain't low on the fuelage. They ain't basically on the EE. -E. Let me go put some gas in this thing. But I appreciate y'all for rocking with me. Yeah, now the price just went up. Now we at like five grand, fifty-five, something like that. Cause I thought it was gonna have a certificate bumper on there, so I was thinking like four. I was thinking I didn't think he was gonna paint the bumper. I thought it was gonna have a black bumper, but the black bumper still would have looked good. But, but now. He painted the bumper, so that's that's five grand. 2014 Impala LT. Yeah, five grand. Nothing less. Five grand, nothing less. Five grand, nothing less. Yeah, go get the oil change. Probably, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know which tires I'm gonna put on the front, which ones I'm gonna put on the back. But I'm gonna let the I'm gonna let the shop tell me which ones to do it the right way. I might just go get, I don't know, I might get, just get, because one's good and one's kind of like got a like different type of tread pattern, so I might try to go find three that's kind of the same tread pattern as the other one, and then just put the one that has a different tread pattern in the trunk as a spare, so in case, you know, they ever have issues, you know, so I paid Wilson, what, he did all this for six, no, 700, 700 is what I paid him, yeah, it was like seven, so yeah, 700. I can't. I guess that's why it was a little bit more expensive than I thought. Cause he ended up painting this bumper. Cause usually I thought I was thinking like it was gonna be like five. And I was like, dang, why is it so? Why is it a little? Why does it seem a little bit more? Like why does it seem, you know, you know, the price is a little, little up. But I can say, ooh, look at those headlights. Look at those headlights. That's my other Impala too. I don't know. I hope not. I really hope not. That'll suck. Hopefully, no oil leaking. I can think of. That'll be nice. Because they ain't coming with this car. They coming from the other Impala. I don't even think I made a video on that Impala yet. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section below. Do y'all want a video on that one too? I'll probably. Because I'm like, do y'all want. Do y'all want to see two Impalas? Or do I just kind of just make, well, I can just make a quick video of kind of what I pay for it and stuff. You know. So, 
So I got about 1,700. Uh, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna just say, round it up to. I'm gonna just say when I'm done, I'm gonna just say 2,000 total into this Impala. So I'm gonna say 2,000 total. <laughs> 2,000 total. Spend 2,000 to make 3,000. Not a bad. And you could probably, I could probably get a little bit more than that. So spend. Gotta get a key fob though. Doesn't have a key fob. So spend 2,000 to make 3,000. It's not a bad return. Not a bad return on it, but not a bad return. They gotta fix that one too. Eventually. My probably the Nissan's been back here so long. It's kind of just like part of the family now. Cause I'm probably never gonna fix it. I'm never gonna get to it. Cause I'm gonna end up buying some more stuff. And I'm gonna push that one to the back because I don't really, I'm not really that worried about it like that. That's fine. Cause really like the car that I drive around from time to time. It's just like a little get around. It's like a little get around. drive it like that it's just how you take it go pick up a part or two here and there that's all i do take it go pick up a part or two here and there and then i park it right back so it's really just like my lock car so i'll probably just throw a bumper on there in the headlight and just use it as my little lot run around car and i have to go get do do stuff and get some things done but i appreciate everybody for tuning in make sure y'all hit that like button make sure y'all subscribe and we out